Let's now take you to Washington, D.C., where Kenya's delegation is hopeful for an extension of the trade deal famously known as AGOA. U.S. officials signaled earlier today that the deal, which expires in 2015, could be extended. Now, President Barack Obama is due to address a news conference later tonight where he will announce new trade deals between his country's firms and Africa. KTN's Joe Agay reports from Washington, D.C. Moments after arriving for his first ever visit to the U.S. since his election last year, President Uhuru Kenyatta went straight to a dinner reception where he would meet former U.S. President Bill Clinton and other leaders. We are genuinely very excited about. But it is the deal signed into law by Clinton 14 years ago that is at the heart of Kenya's interest in this meeting. The Africa Growth and Opportunity Act, famously known as AGOA, this is the deal that seeks to promote U.S. trade and investment in Africa. We are establishing but many countries attending this meeting are now worried because the act is due to expire in September next year. The first priority for all of us is the um, reauthorization of, of AGOA. We want to safeguard the jobs that we already have and the investments uh, that we already have. We also want to inject um, certainty, predictability, and stability in our relations going forward. The United States and its business community need this relationship as much or more as Africa and its business community. President Obama is expected to announce several billions of dollars in investment commitments by U.S. firms on the African continent by the end of this summit. And many here believe Africa is the place to be. Africa is expected to reach a 5% overall growth rate in 2015. It boasts six of the world's 10 fastest growing economies. It registered more than 400,000 new companies in the last year alone. And its middle class or consumer class is the fastest growing in the world. Now, President Uhuru Kenyatta's delegation to this meeting is dominated by business leaders because in the words of some analysts here, this is a meeting of politicians called by a politician. But the deals, if any, will be all about business. Jogeo, KTN, Washington, D.C.